confused no more certain to the patient who have a severe dehydration. delivery room we have mother who has 10 cervical dilatation we are going to start the labor okay we are going to start so mother you have to push 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 this is the baby In the CIG Associate Nursing Program, our mission is to promote awareness and striving for the best healthcare experience for people and communities. Within this, our vision is to be a center of excellence in educating health, health professionals who will positively impact local, national and global health. Here we are in the laboratory of chemistry where we perform different experiments. First, this is a liquid soap. Here are the different materials used to make liquid soap. Around there is a beaker, there is a flask for taking short sample before advanced sample, like this. Uh, this is the salt we use. Uh, this is the ungalo. This is the chemical substances used to make the liquid soap. Here we have a soap, a color. That color caused this liquid soap to seem like that. Uh, here we have ile. This ile make soap live longer. Uh, here we have washing bottle. Those are the equipment or materials used to make liquid soap such like that. As you know, oxygen helps in our daily life, so you have to prepare it. Uh, oxygen helps patients at hospitals to get oxygen as they are suffering suffocation. Oxygen is used in supporting combustion, as you know that oxygen helps in burning. Here is the preparation of it. This is the reagent which is used in, in uh, preparing this oxygen. It is called hydrogen peroxide, and this is manganese dioxide which is used. This is act as a catalyst as we put here, and we put this hydrogen peroxide here, and we let some droplets of hydrogen peroxide as it is coming down. We see we see the fumes, we see these fumes, and after this, here there is the presence of bubbles. So as you see, we are performing uh, an experiment of preparing distilled water. This experiment is used the method which is called simple distillation. As you see, we take a normally tap water or water which is, which is taken from another water body like a liver, and then we heat it at the level it, it starts to evaporate and change into gaseous form. Then we pass it, that gas produced through our condenser where it is cooled and return it for, into its form of liquid state. And when it returns in that form, it, is, it has been distilled without any nutrient. It is purely, as you can see, this one can have a color, but this one has no color. 
this can shows us that there is that water it is it will have been purified through this method. This this water is used in many experiments in this laboratory because it cannot destroy any experimental activity. Just it is there to make a solid chemical into a liquid form. So thank you. This was a setup for in the in simple distillation experiment which is used to purify water into distilled water. Thank you. twe Adventist College impamvu yaneye kuwitamo nuko yako nifuza kuzavamo umuganga wihuguye mu mivure y'ibyenye n'ubwonko n'urutrigongo tufite kibazo cyuko hari abantu menshi bagenda barwara indwara zifata izo ngingo ariko abaganga babasha guhangana n'ibyo bibazo baracyari bake by'umwari ku mugihugu cyacu nize rero ko nzabigeraho kandi ibingi bingambi byanana no gushimira nzego z'ubuyobozi dufite by'umwere ko president Paul Kagame afatanyije na ministeri y'ubuzima ndetse ni uburezi kuko baduhaye baduha amahirwe yo kutangira kwiga science tukiri mu myaka yo hasi tugakora tubizi neza kurutwa twatangira kubyiga twarakuze rero ni ni byiza kandi ndabashimira cyane byibanye ku mutima I decided to do physics, chemistry, com and biology combination after finding that it is the only way to achieve my goal to be a biochemical doctor. Uh, because I have found that in Africa there are no enough biochemical doctors, and then those who are here in Africa they are not enoughly skilled to do that work. You find many vaccines are coming from other continents, but Africa it is still behind in the development of that biochemistry. That's why I, I decided to be a biochemical doctor. I'm very confident I will achieve my goal because there are many factors that prove to me that you achieve it. Like you see, you will find 
the help of other countries in our sciences, like Israelites who helped us to promote our sciences through steam power, which helped us to find an access research about about information. Ask ourselves, you find there help of uh, some religion, religion, religion bodies like Adventists who, who helped us to give us education through their schools. You find their help of our government, especially His Excellency Paul Kagame, which helped us for education for all and promote all ministries contributed to promote children for all. That's why I'm very confident that I will achieve my goal. Thank you.